want to get secret minions and huge minions like I have here? Well, you can see here. I have one Jackson Shell Dark Matter, that means I uh, yes, I have got it six times uh, as a golden one, but it's not only that, I also have one more in the, in, um, the Dark Matter machine, and I actually have gotten um, this 13 times in total, have got this, uh, this um, secret. So I'm gonna tell you how to go forward to get that, it's gonna be the strategy, and also the chance for getting it. Additionally, I have managed also to get two of these huge. They are really good to get in the game, and I'm gonna I'm gonna make a tutorial later on, um, or maybe not a tutorial, just a video explaining how to get on the top 100 in the game. I managed to get up in the top 100 uh, with really short. I've only been playing the game for three weeks, so it's totally possible to manage to do these things here. So, but this one becomes 72 billion since they have the sidekick one always as strong as the, your best minion, and both of them become so I have three minions, 72 billion. And soon I will have one more as well. So how do you get these uh, really beautiful pets here? And then uh, no, no, not pets, minions, right? And also I have managed to get the rockets for, from these missions that you have you're doing here. Absolutely recommend you to complete this mission. You get um, the game pass for free. So that is really, really good to, to get that. So, but what we're gonna use as an example in this video is this huge one, right? So I'm gonna take off um, this one flyer here. And what is the chance for getting a huge? Well, if you look at the chest here now, my it, this is really nice with this game. It's actually standing here. What the chance is is one in hundred eighty-two thousand to get one. That means that for every single egg you open. You can actually get one in your very first egg, or you maybe don't get one on one million eggs. So it doesn't mean that when you open 182,000 eggs, you can get one. It doesn't mean that. It's the chance per single egg that you are opening. Or, or let's say, I, I'm saying eggs, but it's actually chests that we are opening in this game here. So, but the thing is that. I have 182k chance. Well, that is because of some game passes that I have here. So if I do it easier, you see down in the corner, I have this lucky game pass, and I also have the ultra lucky game pass. These game passes is um, it's not extremely expensive. The lucky one is quite okay, and the ultra lucky one is extremely okay. And as you see, it's also helping on secret pets and so on, and also on huge pets. So um, it doesn't state huge here, but it is actually helping on huge pets uh, and so on. So well, it's. It's really really good and look into my video I have made a video about all of the game passes so look in there to see which game passes you will have so if you didn't have a game pass it will be one in two million so because I have the game passes I have already made it easier to get this by far a lot right so so that is one thing that absolutely is recommended but it is still possible to get this without any game passes. The second thing that's going to help tremendously, if you we look on this uh, this formula here now, is 182k, right? So if I go into my boost here, I don't have that many, but and and we don't we don't have a mega luck right now. But if I enable this boost as well, if I take one super lucky on here now, you will see it's 160 one in 125k, which is even even better. It is extremely extremely good for for that. So, but just for this video. I will buy one of these here. I don't I don't never normally buy these ones, but I'm just gonna do it for this video just to show you how good chance we can get here. So if I also am enabled now the mega luck, we will see the chance is one in 55.8k. So this is the best chance you can have before you start hatching. Well, so what is the last thing? The last thing is <clears throat> that you start hatching in, in this game here. By starting hatching, you will see there is a chest lock combo that is coming up here. And you see this is, uh, is zero at the moment. But immediately when I pass 50 eggs, it will start to get up. So this will come to its maximum when it's at 7.5 and 5,000 uh, chest hatched. And then the chance is becoming even better than it normally has. So absolutely recommend you to try to use this together um, to try to get them. So normally what's really good to do is that you hatch when you play actively. You, you farm and farm and farm and you gather up a lot of these um, 
I, it depends which secret you after. There's secret in all of the different worlds. So for now, it's a Halloween event right now when I make this video. That's why I take this um, Halloween uh, corn candy, and I have gathered up a lot of them. You can see I have 147 trillion of them, and that is making so that I can hatch for like 24 hours if I want to do that. So that is the technique that you definitely use, and that is the core and the most important thing that you have. Regardless if you have the game passes or you have the lucky potions on, even st hatching like many, 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 like thousands of egg without any game pass and any potion is the most important thing. It's it's normally in the numbers where when you're getting something like this, right? So basically, learn to stay AFK in the game hatching, and you see here it's starting to getting up here, and it is actually affecting the chance of getting this minion here. So so that that is for sure. You can also stop. The hatching I think it's maybe for 60 seconds or something and then you can continue and you will keep your combo so that will say if your game crash and you are fast getting in again you still will keep the combo you can actually swap from one server to another server and you can keep the combo but it, I think it's if it goes more than 60 seconds you will lose that combo and yeah well so this is the chance and the way you're gonna do it so it is in hatching for a long 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 time um, in a row to keep that combo up to the maximum and that is so important to do the second thing that you have to think about is to make a really good farming team it means to have how many pets you can have mounted and also how strong is those pets the reason for this is that you want to use less time farming to get the candy or crystals that you need or games that you need and more time hatching so <clears throat> the more time you use hatching, the more ha chests you can open and the more chance you're gonna have for getting those secret or, 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 or good pets. And that's uh, to make a good team, it's not all of, or only about having strong pets always. When it comes to the candy cane, it is actually about getting the, as strong as possible. So it is about tuning a little bit. Sometimes if I'm gonna get my maximum, I actually have to turn off my huge pets and also turn off some of these other ones and then I hatch um, in in a way where 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 is dinosaur uh, where is it there we have it in dinosaur so where, if I take the, the team that I took now and, and hatch in dinosaur I can easily do like 150 million per chest that are breaking but if I make my team stronger it will actually be really low for that but if we go back to like for let's see go to the last world like in the future when the Halloween event is over we're gonna it's gonna be important with, with this one here and if I now just go in here and enable let's put on some uh, triple games and triple damage and you're gonna see how fast I'm breaking down this chest here now and that is also really important. When we get to, into that uh, thing, there's other thing. It's not just the strength that is important. It's also going to be important to have really good enchants. And one good enchant is the Alpha 2. It's a really good one. And other, let me see if I can find one here. Yeah, Fire Gem uh, 4, 4 is really, really good one as well. So, and Fire Gem 5, like this one. Fire Gem 5 and Lucky 1. So making a team with a lot of pets that has Fire Gem... Five will you also make you earn way more and so on. So basically, it, it's um, it's quite important also to build a really good farming team, and also uh, earn as much of those candy cane or or corn that you can do um, to 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 get as as, as good as possible, right? I'm I'm right now on a server where you see I only have 1.4 friend bonus. It's not that much, but I'm just gonna end up here showing that the last thing I was talking about here. You're gonna see when I break this chest now, I'm gonna get really low, just like seven, eight hundred k. It, it, it's not much, right? But if I turn off, um, let oh, we we want to have that one. I turn off both my huge. Let's see, I can also turn off some of these ones here, and we're gonna see now. At one point, I'm gonna earn tremendously. It's like you get to a certain limit. This is different from player to player, so you just have to fine tune. And you see here, suddenly I got 142 million. If I now go back and equip all here again, you're gonna see I'm gonna get like five, six, seven hundred k. So 
it is about understanding the game, investigate the game, uh, analyze the game, and try to build teams to try to get the maximum. The one I just show now is just for the Halloween event. It is not for normal. For normal, it is about getting good enchants, as I'm telling and so on. But I'm gonna tell more about this um, in video later on. But also go and look my video about enchanting, how to to make a really good farming team in the game. But next up, I will come with how to get them top 100. Thank you. This was normal one game of that Viper Toffee. Like and subscribe, and bye bye.